Welcome back, back, back to the Shake, Rattle, and Roll with Steve Wilton and the greatest WWE Intercontinental Champion of all time, the Honky Tonk Man. Welcome back to Shake, Rattle, and Roll fans. Uh, champ, I think it's time to call our special guest. Okay, you want to give to give him a ring? It's uh, I, I'll tease the people just a little bit because a big a big part of our show going out now is 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 of course the uh, rhythm and blues reunion uh, uh, show, and that's what we do. It's a it's a reunion of rhythm and blues, and uh, I think he's he he might be ready to to shake, rattle, and roll. Greg Hammer Valentine. Yeah, that's me. You're live on shake, rattle, and roll with uh, Steve and the Honky Tonk Man. All right. How would you feel about teaming up with HCM and touring around the country? Well, we did it a long time ago, and we always we had a great tag team together. This is going to be a this is going to be a great new experience. Uh, we get to stand on stage and talk about our lives in the WWF or WWE, whatever. And uh, I'm looking forward to it. It's gonna it's gonna be unique. It's gonna be it's gonna be new, and it's gonna be great for all the fans to see us in this different setting and to to really uh hear what really went on back in the day the real day when wrestling was wrestling there's there's a lot of there's so many stories that uh uh you know it just i don't have anything that, that pops in my head right away at any time but uh when i get out in front of the audience uh, there's no cue cards there's nothing we don't pre-screen any of the questions uh, and uh you know Driving along with a hammer, it was always uniquely different because every day was different out on the road. And some days we would have Jimmy Hart with us, and that would always add a little uh, uh, extra uh, excitement. But uh, typically, when Greg and I were together alone, uh, we just did our own thing and tried to, uh, you know, make our matches as mo- as entertaining as we could uh, with the people that we had. Now, when Rhythm and Blues was put together, we weren't given the best tag teams to work with. Uh, you know, we were thrown in there with the Bushwhackers sometimes, and uh, uh, those were different. I mean, uh, to work with those two fellows, uh, great guys, they enjoyed it, but it was it was a challenge, and, and we worked through it and made it work. And then, uh, you know, the WWE, they they come along, and they make changes to everything. And, and then uh, uh, when they find out two guys are trying to get along and trying to work hard, then they sometimes they separate you and send you on your merry way, and that's what happened to us. And then, uh, but that's okay. Hey, they they only separate us temporarily. We're back together and then. And, and now this show, this show that we're doing is going to be so big. It's going to so many places that uh, the fans are going to truly, truly be entertained. I can I can promise you that. Would you say is a kind of PG thirteen show? Is a kind of no questions off limits? As far as I'm concerned, I mean, we we keep the show uh, as clean as we can. Most of these shows are going to be nighttime, and they're adult only. There's a couple of shows coming up that that'll have children in them, but uh, you know, every now and again, I'll say the the uh, MF word or the, you know, or by God, Jim Ross <laughs> bullshit. I have to I have to throw that in every now and again. Greg, Greg's okay. not a Greg's not a big he's not a big uh, 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 bad language person. He never has been, and uh, but I, I, you know, I can cover all that. Believe me. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. oh, it's going to be oh yes, fantastic. And yeah, you know, we got shows in April and May, June, July, and it's just going to keep on coming. We're going to have a great. We're going to have a great time. Well, we look forward to seeing you out there, and all the fans do too. Uh, they've asked about you, and uh, they did want to know if you're going to have your hair black and. Since I don't have mine black anymore, you don't have to have yours black. So we'll both go as blonde. Well, I'm, I'm actually I'm gray, so so that's okay. Oh, Mine's maybe gray I'll be now. gray too there. <laughs> yeah, yeah, that's 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 gonna be great. Anyway, thanks for coming on the show, and I'll see you out in uh, Roswell, New Mexico, April twenty seventh. 